Well, in a major scientific achievement, Chinese researchers have successfully cloned the first racist monkey, a species renowned for its importance in medical research due to its psychological similarities to humans. The cloned monkey is named Retro. It has remained in good health for over two years, marking a remarkable stride in cloning technology. This breakthrough comes from a team at the University of Chinese Academy of Sciences. Now, these scientists utilized a technique known as trophoblast replacement. Earlier methods that were used to clone a racist either did not lead to any births or many other cases, the offspring died within hours of its birth. This method aimed to address previous challenges encountered in cloning the monkeys. The researchers used 113 embryos, which are building block cells that can grow into any part of an organism. 11 of which were implanted into a surrogate monkey. They, let, they later achieved two pregnancies and one live birth. In Asia, racist monkeys can be seen roaming freely. Their populations can be found from Afghanistan through India, Thailand, Vietnam and China. Experts use them to study immunity and infection. Now, researchers have expressed joy over the successful outcome of the experiment. They have highlighted the potential implications for drug testing, suggesting that the identical animals could enhance the reliability of trial results. However, not everyone is celebrating this achievement. The UK's Royal Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals has voiced deep concerns. They have emphasized the potential for animal suffering and calling for further ethical scrutiny. The organization questions the immediate benefits to human patients versus the distress experienced by the animals involved. The most famous cloned animal, Dolly the sheep, was created in 1996. Scientists reprogrammed a cell from, from another sheep to turn them into embryos and this were then implanted into Dolly's mother. 